What's going on my bears? Welcome back to the channel. For those of you who are new here, my name is Andrew and I'll be your food guide for today. Today we're right outside uh, Jimbocho Station. It's uh, Tokyo Metro Station. Pretty close to Tokyo, pretty close to Ueno Station as well. It's not that far of a ride out. Uh, today we're eating at Yakisoba Mikasa. And Yakisoba is basically just a fried up noodle dish, kind of similar in taste to okonomiyaki. I found this place online and it's supposedly one of the best yakisoba places in Tokyo. And so, pretty excited to try it out. I'm really hungry and very cold, so I'm gonna go ahead, go inside, sit down and order my delicious food. All right, we are seated and I've already placed my order. All that's left is to wait for the delicious yakisoba. So there isn't really a menu here. It's pretty much just one, one little vending machine. They don't have that many options. It's a very quaint, small, little restaurant or diner. Not really sure what you want to call it. It has a really good atmosphere to it and I'm pretty excited to eat. I'm really hungry. All right, so my order has arrived. Here it is, the yakisoba. Looks super delicious. There we go. All right, there's, dang, there's shrimps, scallops. So I guess this is the seafood option. There's a lot of sprouts in here. A nicely cooked egg. Ooh, this is really good. Let's try this out. Mm. This is super delicious. I've never had seafood that tender before in my life, actually. It's incredibly flavorful. The sauce is a really nice mixture of sweet and savory. This is definitely the best yakisoba I've ever eaten. The portion they give here is really good too. I'm gonna add some pickle ginger. The pickled ginger really helps a lot. Almost a necessity. Just like that, I'm done. Fish this thing real quick. I do want to try the sauce a little bit though. Just to see what it is. Mm. The sauce is actually really nice. Anyway, people are waiting for a seat. So I'm gonna get out of here. See you outside. All right, talk about a meal. Oh my goodness. So the large portion yakisoba that I ate was 900 yen. Uh, so right around $8. And for how much you get and the quality of everything, that's a screaming deal. I can definitely see why it's so highly regarded as one of the best yakisoba places in Tokyo. I wasn't actually expecting such a small venue, but it kind of gives it a little bit more charm and gives it a really great atmosphere. I was really lucky uh, the time that I went, it was actually pretty empty, but as soon as I was done eating and finished filming, there was a line coming out the door. 
So definitely try to avoid the rush hours during dinner time. Uh, the place actually does close at 7 p.m. So I would say you'd probably want to get in there around maybe 4 to 5.30, somewhere around then. Uh, I came in at right about 6 and there wasn't many people. I didn't have to wait at all. I could definitely recommend coming to this place if you are lucky enough to go on a trip to Tokyo. Make sure you check it out. Anyway, that's all for now. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe so you don't miss the next video. And until then, stay hungry.